Hello, my friends! It's story time, and I'm so excited because we get to read a story together, and not only do you get to see the story, but you also get to see my face. So today we'll be reading Mouse Paint, but before we read, I always like to do our story time song. So we're going to do it together, and I know this is your first time hearing it, but we'll get more comfortable as we read more stories together. So here we go. Are you ready for a story? Eyes are watching, ears are listening, mouth is sit. Great. So today we're going to be reading Mouse Paint, and the author of Mouse Paint is Ellen Stoll Walsh, and the author means that she wrote the book, which is really cool. So we get to read a book that she wrote. Here we go. Once there were three white mice on a white piece of paper. The cat couldn't find them. One day, while the cat was asleep, the mice saw three jars of paint. One red, one yellow, and one blue. Good job. They thought it was mouse paint. They climbed right in. Then one was red, then one was yellow, and one was blue. They dripped puddles of paint onto the paper. What happens next? The puddles looked like fun. The red mouse stepped into a yellow puddle and did a little dance. Ooh, what do you think happens? His red feet stirred the yellow puddle until... Look! He cried. Oh no, what happens? Red feet in a yellow puddle make orange. Good job. The yellow mouse hopped into a blue puddle. His feet mixed and stirred and stirred and mixed until... Look down, said the red mouse and the blue mouse. Uh-oh, what do you think happens? Yellow feet in a blue puddle make... Green! Then the blue mouse jumped into a red puddle. Good job, my friends. He splashed and mixed and danced until... Uh-oh, what do you think happens? Purple! They all shouted. Blue feet in a red puddle make purple! But the paint on their fur got sticky and stiff. So they washed themselves down into a nice soft white and painted the paper instead. They painted one part red, one part yellow, and one part blue. Good job, my friends. They mixed red and yellow to paint a orange part. And they mixed yellow and blue to paint a green part. And blue and red to paint a purple part. But they left some white because of the cat. The end. My friends, did you like my story? It wasn't that so cool, the mice, and they played with all those colors. And did you know that when you put two colors together, you can get another color like the mice did? So they mixed red and yellow, and it made orange. And they mixed red and blue together, and it made purple. And they mixed blue and yellow together, and it made green. But they left a part, what color? White. Good job. And they left it white because they were scared of the cat. Why do you think they were scared of the cat? <gasps> maybe. That's a great answer. Yep, maybe that's it too. You guys are so smart and I love all of your answers. Well, I'm so glad we got to paint. We got to read mouse paint together. And if you'd like to read it again, you can just replay the video. But it was a super fun story and I'm glad we were able to do it together. Thank you so much for tuning in to our story time. Bye-bye for now.